In tonight's State of the Nation, Democrats are speaking out again against the separation of immigrant families. Today, Senator Richard Blumenthal and others talked about the policy needing to be changed. Attorney General Jeff Sessions says there is no other choice but to take kids away from their parents if they try to enter the country illegally. Morgan Wright reports. Members of Congress continue to demand the Trump administration stop their policy of ripping families apart, separating immigrant kids from their parents at the border. Literally thousands of children are in prison, there's no other term for it, in this great country for no other crime than trying to escape persecution, death, torture. The Trump administration's policy enacted last month prosecutes all adults for illegal entry, even if they attempt to seek asylum. The policy has led to families being torn apart. Connecticut Senator Richard Blumenthal says the costs are enormous in humanity terms and financial. Attorney General Jeff Sessions says these actions will not end or reduce legal immigration, but it will reduce illegal immigration. It's no surprise that people want to come here, but they must do so according to law. Speaker of the House Paul Ryan says the separation of children from their parents at the border should be addressed by immigration legislation. What's happening at the border and the separation of parents and their children is because of a court ruling. That's why I think legislation is necessary. House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi says this policy has to stop. This is not normal. In fact, it's barbaric. In Washington, Morgan Wright. The Senate Democrats have introduced the Keeping Families Together Act to prevent children being taken from their parents at the borders. Speaker of the House Paul Ryan says next week they'll debate the process of fixing the immigration system.